Welcome back. This is my friend and future sister-in-law, Rachel. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and we're just going to do our makeup together today. Um, fall themed is our plan. Yeah, um, I'm going to do some oranges and uh, purples, I think. And you are going gold. I yeah, think. I think I'm going like gold and bronze. And like copper colors. Yeah. So, um, I have a lot of shimmers too, which is kind of odd for me, but... Yeah, you don't usually... Yeah, yeah you don't... We're, I feel like we're switching, because I'm going... Yeah. Like, all very plain colors, but... Yeah. Maybe we should switch palettes. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's possible. <laughs> we might have to see how this works. <laughs> um, okay, so neither of us have anything on at all for makeup, so... Um, I'm just gonna go in with the Mineral Touch foundation, and this is like a mix. I like mixed a whole bunch of colors, okay. so I don't know what color it is. I just created it. So um, I'm gonna start with my eyeshadow first. Um, when I'm using darker colors, it tends to end up all over my face, and I don't want to have to redo all of my foundation once I'm done. So. All right. All right. I think I I think that's why I do this instinctively. Is I put one of the cream eyeshadows on first and then I do it so it like sticks to this. Yeah. And I don't end up with yeah. much fallout. Yeah. I'm using um, Urban Decay eyeshadow primer. Um, this one's the, like it. It's not really tinted. It's more of like a concealer color. Um, it does sort of change the color of your eyeshadow, but I get a lot of redness on my, um, like my brow bone area and like veins, oh. I guess, up here. So I, I do like to use this. Can I see your brush? Absolutely. What's, what's the brush? The, so this is for a liquid. Yeah. Foundation. Yeah. Okay. Cause I, I've never used a brush for liquid foundation. Oh, really? No. You just use your fingers? Yes, or like, um... Because I can, I can do, you're right, I can do either one. I've never, I've just, like it's got a hole in it. <laughs> it's, it's like, yeah, it's a little weird, but it's like supposed to like buff it in. Okay. Um, I don't know, I, it's funny, usually in the morning I'll use my fingers just because I hate washing makeup brushes. And yeah. I feel like I make so much of a mess that I use my fingers way more. Than I should, I think. See, I don't use my fingers for anything really but this and then foundation later. Oh, see, I could use my fingers for all the eyeshadow. Too. Yeah, I, I, I <laughs> see you, you usually do. I, I don't think you're supposed to, but that's what I do. Um, I like the brushes because I feel like I can blend color a little bit more. Mm -hmm. um, especially when you're using darker colors, the key is. Blend, 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 blend. Like I always felt like I looked like a psycho with dark makeup on, and it was just because I was doing it wrong. You have to, you have to blend everything. Blending definitely helps. I agree. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm just doing like a nude shade um, up top. Is that the Naked Basics? Um. Yes. Oh, Ultimate, Ultimate ba Basics. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. And they're all matte. Yeah, this is like, I'm surprised you don't, like, I'm surprised yeah. that you're using those and I'm using these. Today. Yeah, I agree. Because this is right up your alley. Yeah, it definitely is. But I like, I like these, you get a lot of, there, you get a lot of, I just going the wrong way, a lot of variety with, backwards. um, colors, but you have a lot of neutral options. So this is what I use for my everyday stuff usually. Yeah. Um, if I'm, cooler and then warmer yeah and if I'm going out like I you know that's when I break out like my sparkly stuff but <laughs> this is what I use pretty much day to day okay I just did velour concealer I've been doing it's weird because my hair is like reddish now so I feel like I also switch up what I do you like, kind of have purple yeah it's like a I really like that I didn't even notice that it was thank you I yeah when I so I mixed I originally dyed it I mixed black in with like purple and red, and it's like I forgot how dark black is. <laughs> like so it mostly went black with like a little twinge. So then I was like, oh, I want more. So I got purple haze, manic panic purple haze, and vampire red. 
and mix those two. And then I left that on for like, I don't know, like two or three hours. And then rinse that out. I love the color. That's, I, that's so, perfect on you. I really like this for like fall. Mm -hmm. But I liked, it's funny, I really liked wearing, like I wore unapologetic. Like when I had blonde hair, mm -hmm. I felt like this looked so good and I was like really drawn to like warmer colors. Okay. And it's okay. like my skin's the same, you know, but like for some reason I was drawn to like different colors in my hair. I think you could go either way though with your, your eye color and skin tone. I feel like yeah. you can go, I think you could go warm or cool. Yeah. I usually look better with warmer colors, but I'm going to be using both today. So yeah. just going rogue. <laughs> and it's funny because we do do the opposite with our order. Yeah. Okay. This is just a nudie, nudie eyeshadow. It's nudie. Nudie. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't make it up. That's awesome. See, someone gets paid a lot of money to come up with that stuff. Uh, genius. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't have thought of that one. <laughs> I think you would. I'm doing my brows. I've been doing my brows with just the proud um, matte splurge and then the brow brush. Just because mine. Is this an eyeshadow? Yeah. Do, does Unique have any eyebrow? Yes, yeah, so there's a brow palette. Yeah. Alright. I'm using Extra Bitter. It's kind of a brown ish orange color it it's it's brown but it comes out i think looking a little bit copper or orange i'm just gonna use that in the creases and don't mind me i'm just massacring my eyebrow i don't know why i must have put like way too much product on that time i have enough to like do three people's eyebrows right now I'm like, let's blend it out, it's all good. Buff it out. Really. Yeah. Nobody will notice, no big deal. It's good okay. enough. Um, <clears throat> I have a, like a buff crease brush that I use for this. Um, pretty sure this is just an Ulta brand brush. It was probably like six dollars or something but it really helps to blend so okay i'm gonna go right in with proud which is the dark brown and i think i'm gonna map out what i'm gonna do with this like cream eyeshadow first and then i'll put other stuff on top of it all right i'm gonna go purple going purple oh my god it's so dark <laughs> okay, and like I said, the key is definitely to blend because I'm about to look like a psycho. You are not. I look like I not. And you have me like, I'm going in with dark brown right away. <sighs> I hear the football game. I kind of want to go check the score. <laughs> I do not care about sports at all. I know. I feel bad. I feel like I'm supposed to. I'm like un-American or something, but I just don't care. Uh, I put stuff in the crock pot. You used the crock pot? I am using the crock pot. Jen. I'm so excited. What did you make? Uh, oh, so it was like a pre-made thing. Um, it's from Aldi. It came like with beef and then a flavor packet and then um, like veggies. So you just had to like literally put it all in together with like a cup of water and then it told you like the amount of time. So I put in some more like frozen veggies because I didn't think there were that many. I kind of wanted a little bit more. Okay. But yeah. And it smell it smells pretty good. Like if you go It sounds good. It sounds yeah. easy. I've never used one of those. I'll check it out. Yeah, I didn't even Yeah, I never used it before either, but I need that because I can't do like seasoning and stuff. I don't know what to do. One eye. Oh. So blend is a nice. All right, so I have like, this is my little plan here. Hello, fall. Um, so I'm gonna try 
I don't know. I feel like this is a lot. Okay, I'm gonna try. I don't know the name of this one. Okay. Astute. All that to find out the name. Okay. Alright. I really like that gold. This one? Yeah. Fanatical. I like that a lot. The names are so weird. Alright, so I'm gonna start with a matte astute and I'm gonna put that in my crease and blend it up. I feel like we have to go out after this. Just go, we can go walk around the mall. <laughs> <laughs> go hang out in the food court. <laughs> like, it's really dramatic <laughs> eye. Like, I'm wearing like jeans and a t-shirt, but I have like a smoky eye. Get an Aeropostel or something. <laughs> I was trying to get mom to go to uh, DSW. Okay, I'm putting it on the lower lash line too. Cause like she always, okay, Penny's like knocking over lights here. She always needs shoes. Cause you just can never have too many. Mm -mm. And I'm like, well, let's just check out their clearance. And she's like, well, I don't really have any money. And I'm like, but you do. You have enough to, like, if there's a really good pair of shoes on clearance. Well, she's uh, saving money for the poppy. Yes. So, <clears throat> Phyllis is adopting a poppy named Nancy Ann. I told her she can't keep the name. Me and, me and Laura were trying to get her to name it Tater Tot. I mean, texted her last night. That was after. That's th cute. That was though. after a few beers, but. <laughs> tater Tot is cute, though. She was like, what's the matter with you, too? She <laughs> like, this is, oh my god. This is why I shouldn't put stuff on my. Because then I do that. What is that? It's, I don't know, like eyebrow stuff that I like wiped across my face. <laughs> Because I'm not using brushes like a normal person, and I'm using my hands. And that's why you should do foundation last. Ugh. Valid point. Okay. It does make sense. Okay. All right, I'm kind of digging the way this looks. Um, okay, I'm gonna do I fanatical. was going to do liquid liner, but my hands are feeling a little shaky today, and. I think I'll just end up redoing it about 600 times. So what I sometimes do is use black eyeshadow and a really thin brush. I'm gonna try to like, is it cause I'm short? Is it cause both I'm of us, It's because both <laughs> of us are short. Um, and I use this instead and you can kind of blend it in and it gives you it's not as sharp of a look, but okay. um, so it's like a little more smoky. Yeah, I'm a yeah, I'm a little bit um, liquid liner challenged. So <laughs> I find this to be a really good alternative to to doing that. I'm doing optimistic now in the inner corner. I always thought like, I was like, oh, I'll just use a couple colors. And then like five minutes later, I'm like on my seventh color. And I'm like, oh, how do I do that? Okay, so I'm gonna, I think I am gonna use a whole bunch of colors. I think I'm only like skipping one. So I'm gonna use nonsensical now in like the outer corner. So this is matte and then I wanna put manipulative over it. So I'm gonna start with this and then put that over it. Mine's like darker than I, I don't know. It is fall though. Mm hmm Well, it doesn't feel like it's fall. I know, this is probably the hottest day of the year and it's freaking end of September. Yeah. It's so brutal. It's very weird. I'm not quite sure why the weather is. Well, when we had this idea, we were like, oh, we'll do fall offs, it's the perfect time. And instead it's like, we should just be at the pool today because. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> Hey, you're on speakerphone. Hey, hey. What's going on? Me and Jen are doing our makeup. How's your makeup? I'm gonna borrow your mascara if you don't care. Yeah, do it. 
because uh, mine's pretty dried out. Yeah, absolutely. At the moment. Well, this is a nice mascara. Yeah, I like it. I really feel like it gets like every little lash. Well, that's all I have is uh, <laughs> like five little lashes. <laughs> okay, I'm also, I think I like the idea of like it being a little bit smokier, so I'm just using dark brown eyeliner. I'm not using liquid eyeliner. I debated it too. It's not the day for it. Yeah, I just don't think it is, yeah. Sunday, no liquid liner on Sundays. That's definitely a roll. Definitely. I feel like this made my eyelash is really long. Oh, it really does. Yeah, you already have long ones. I'm so, yeah, yeah, I'm so jealous of you for the good lashes. I'm shocked you got me out of the house with no makeup on. <laughs> I totally did. A, a rare, a rare occurrence. It's a, it's a unicorn sighting. <laughs> I feel like I always have something, whether it's like just mascara or like. Because your skin's really nice, so you could definitely just do mascara. My skin is really isn't, and that's like I have a lot of like larger pores on my nose, like a lot of like I have some like burst blood vessels or something like I, I don't have even a lot of them too I actually thought that they might be from drinking but I just think fair skinned people get them yeah because that used to be quite the no I don't I don't think it's from drinking especially like you stopped drinking years ago and like yeah you were younger I don't think it's from drinking I think that happens when you get a few years older and yeah. You can get them from like sun damage and stuff too. Uh, I did used to go out in the sun. I don't anymore, obviously. <laughs> Hence, I look like a vampire, but... <laughs> I Once I saw the sun. <laughs> this one time. <laughs> I remember that guy. Uh, I did. There, back in the day, there was... We used to use sun in and peroxide in our hair and just like lay outside of my mouth. I was worried that that would make my hair a little orange. Oh, it did. It made your hair orange? Oh yeah. Oh, See, yeah. and I wonder, I think it's because- it had to go through orange in order to get to blonde. But I think it's because you had dark hair. So exactly. I, I, on me, I wonder if, it, if my hair would just really lighten up, like if it would just highlight me a bit. Yeah. But then when you do that, it's, it's really hard to like start correcting that. So if it turned out horrible, if I went to a salon, they'd be like, why did you- Yeah. Why did you use sun in? Why didn't you just come here in the first place? Yeah. It's like because I wanted to spend $7, not $70. Let's go like neutral on the lips because I feel like bold looks don't really look good on me with like a bold lip. Except if I do like when I just did the red lip and I had like everything else was really chill. I liked that. Um, there's, they, they, whoever they are, say you're, you're kind of supposed to pick one. Yeah. You know? I'm gonna do I'm gonna do dark lips and I feel like the color might clash because I decided to go purple with my eyeshadow. But the lip color is the only thing I'd picked out. <laughs> <laughs> so like I'm sticking to it, I'm yeah, doing it. Yeah. I like this one, so I used light brown lip liner and then I used the new it's called Superior. Uh, liquid lipstick, but I have done this just the liquid lipstick during the day at work. I like this. Let me see. Is this it? Yeah. So I used this first. This one was gold. Yeah. Too. So I kind of yeah. Do you I have like any unique BB creams that would fit my color? So you would probably be, I think, honey. I don't want to go heavy foundation today. Uh, see, this is this is me, so I think you're. I don't know if you'd be this or one up. Give it a go. I don't think I have any honey though. I only have. That's kind of a lot that I just use. Oh, it's well, it's really light, but <laughs> but it's thick. It's a lot thicker than I thought it would be. It's really really creamy. Yeah. 
I like this. Yeah. I don't, um, I don't really love wearing liquid foundations anymore. I just, like, I, I do, if I have an event or something, like a wedding, but I just find it, I just find it too heavy. I feel like, um, I feel like it's just dripping off of me all day. I don't, I just don't care for it. But this is nice. This is so creamy. Yeah, it really is. So I do think you're probably up a shade. Yeah, this isn't um, really, this isn't, I mean, I, I can pull it off, but it's not, it's not dead on for yeah, me. Yeah, yeah, I think you would be up one. Well, um, I'm going to set it with some powder, but. Oh, I didn't do that. I think I, as I've gotten older, I use less powder. Yeah, I, like, and yeah. honestly, it's just if I'm, like, going out or something usually is when I do this. Like, it's usually one or the other or none nowadays. Is it bare minerals? Yeah. Okay. And this is, I mean, I'm using, like, a buffing brush, which really isn't what you're supposed to put this on with at first, but... I think it helps <clears throat> blend together the BB cream and the foundation. Yeah. and That is like a nice finish. Yeah. So I have this Wonder Stick. <laughs> what? I wonder who came what? up with that name. <laughs> Was it maybe a guy? <laughs> the nudie. nudie. <laughs> um, and it's for contouring. So I, I mean, a lot of women do all over face contouring and you know their nose and stuff like that I don't do that I really just like to kind of do my cheeks a little bit um I like the I, I just like the way it looks so I agree so not like I have like a kind of big forehead Mom and I had that discussion because I told her I'd get it from her and she's like, I have a big forehead and I was like, um, we kind of have a big forehead. No. So like you, yours is smaller. Yeah, so I don't, so I don't. you don't need to. No, do you, so do you, do you do up here? Yeah. Okay. So I do like bronzer and I do like across the forehead and then down the cheeks. So. But I don't do the nose either. Yeah, I just, and then I put this on and then I just like blend it with my, my buffing brush and it. Ends up being a pretty decent, like, yeah, ones it pretty good. Um, and uh, my gem membership, <laughs> the least, <laughs> the least used thing on my key ring. I don't even think I have the key one. I joined the gym again. Which one? Thankfully, only the Planet Fitness. Okay. It's only, I'm only throwing away ten dollars a month by not going to the gym. I just, I don't enjoy it. I feel like maybe people do. And I don't, so I shouldn't go. I... Does anyone enjoy it? I like my gym for... Oh Jesus, I look like a nut. I like my gym for the classes. Pilates and yoga and like, just like group cardio classes and stuff like that. I think that they get me a little bit more motivated because okay. you're kind of forced to like, step it up and pick it up a little bit because you don't want to look like a dick in front of a bunch of people you don't know but you see every week so a bunch of people you don't know right and you don't see any other place okay so in order to do this look again I would not use this lip color with this I, I feel like it matches yeah but it's okay, a it's just... a lot of purple this would be nice for Halloween, maybe, <laughs> but I not an everyday I'm... look. I usually when I wear this lip color, I I go um, I use a lot of golds, a lot of neutral colors. Like I do a really neutral eye and then a dark lip. But okay, um, I picked the lip color out first, and I was sticking to it. So that's this really nice. is um, Anastasia. I think that's how I say it. I never say it like that because like it's Anastasia, right? Yeah. Okay. Anastasia, yeah. okay, um, Veronica, and I saw somebody wearing this online and like had to buy it because yeah. I, but it's a really nice matte liquid lipstick and I love it. Yeah, that's a really pretty color. So, so we're ready fall, right. <laughs> we're on your pumpkins and your leaves and your pumpkin spice everything. I don't eat any pumpkin spice Can stuff. We, like I like apple stuff. Yeah, apple cider. Why isn't that as cool? I don't know. These people are 
demons. Yeah, where are the apple cider mm -hmm. uh, people, committees? Committees. Yeah, um, <laughs> I, I, pref I prefer apple cider, I think, to pumpkin, anything. I don't, yeah. I don't drink pumpkin coffee or whatever. I, I don't mean, eat pumpkin pie either. Pretty excited about the hot turkey coming back to Wawa. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, it's the best time of year. It is. All right, guys, so thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed our, our fall-themed look, <laughs> and we will see you again soon.